This journey began with a single gunshot. That day, the rain poured like its contract was to cleanse the earth of her innocent blood. Some say there were no clouds, and that the angels cried her death each droplet of rain carrying away its weight in blood deep into the earth. She lay in pain with a smile, not unusual for her. Everyone was a friend she hadn't met yet. Death wasn't any different, so she welcomed him like family. As her soul poured out to begin its journey back to its creator, I held her lips to my ears to ease her words as they made their last pilgrimage to my heart. It was then I realized that all I could hear amongst the frenzy was my heart's cry, squeezing hate with each pump, providing reason for revenge while frantically searching for a means of her survival. But with the little life she had left, she whispered, Forgive them, but never forget me. And just like that, her life ended the same way I fell in love with her. A smile. You can argue that if the bullet that struck her chest knew the destiny, it would transform into her favorite bird and sing her a song or two. Flashbacks began to surface of how often we sat at the edge of the forest during sunrise, pondering the freedom of flight, how life could end at any moment and that we should live like it's our last but love like it's our first. It was then I heard footsteps. I reached to place a kiss, but before I could plant it, I felt cold steel in the back of my head. 